No. Them is a 2006 French Romanian horror slash thriller film about a young teacher and her writer boyfriend getting attacked in their remote country house. For most of the time, we have no idea who or what entity is causing these strange phenomena, just as the characters in the film. There are strange noises during the night, it plays around with their power line, and it seems to be in multiple places at once. So we follow the couple as we see them try anything to survive the night. According to the film, it was based on a true story, but that's a really misleading leading way of putting it, it's more like inspired by a true story, parenthesis, kinda. It was shot on location, they were actually in a big old house that was apparently so large, they didn't even use all of the rooms in there. The production lasted for some 30 days, and our main lead, Olivia, apparently suffered from actual claustrophobia when shooting some of the sequences here, so... There's that. What I liked about them and movies like this in general is the fact that you can tell this is just a bunch of filmmakers who are passionate about what they do and decided to come together and make something. They're not trying to impress anyone. They're not trying to shock the world. They're not trying to convey anything sophisticated. And they're not being self-indulgent because them is about nothing but the filmmaking itself. It's a group of filmmakers simply making something for fun. And that's it. So in that nature, I think this movie is very fun. It was written by the same dude who made Climax and Irreversible with Gaspar Noe. Surprisingly, the cinematography is pretty much all handheld and it has a very early 2000s cheap digital camera look to it, even though it seems like a smart choice here financially, and you can argue artistically, considering the budget to the thing, the movie does look a little cheaper than it should. It is at times very dark to a point you can barely see a thing, while I think it adds a layer of realism, sometimes is a bit unnecessary. The lighting is minimum, they utilize the best they could, this constant flashing and moving lights creating the tension and aesthetic is very pretty, however, I thought they really went overboard with it towards the final 10 minutes. It's a bit too hard to focus. The film is actually very well edited. The quick and disorientating cuts are never distracting because a lot of the times our characters are just as confused as you and the way to convey that in this case is to bring you with them through editing. The movie is only 73 minutes long with the credit and now looking back, they really took a while to set up everything. Despite the prologue that does not serve the story much but grabs your attention, it took almost 30 minutes into the film for the first strange thing to happen to our main protagonist and by that point, we're pushing to the midpoint already. The final reveal of who is actually doing these things while it completely took me by surprise it's not really consistent with what they've shown and set up earlier in the film, let that be the silhouettes or the shadows we see. It's not quite earned in an organic matter technically. I like the way the writer shifts our perspectives with different characters. The film doesn't treat the two main leads as one entity. They're not always together and by doing that, it kind of expands the story world just a little bit bigger. In the end, I think Them is a well-made movie about nothing but the filmmaking. You can kind of shit some sort of message out but I think there's no point of doing that with this movie. It is a series of entertaining and fun set pieces that funnel to this one claustrophobic horror thriller about a home invasion. It is well cast, well performed, well edited, and it does not bombard you with opinions. It has a very cool tunnel scene. Incredible stuff. I'm going to give them a B-. minus. Go check it out if you just want a fun home invasion movie. I think this one does the job. Mm -hmm.